Hello everyone, Sodius here, and today we are going to play Life is Strange. I first heard about this game when me and Andrew were up in London. Uh, we got invited to a press event where they showed off this game, and it was very impressive. It was pretty much a no-brainer. As soon as this game came out on Steam, I went ahead and pre-purchased it right away. So I am really excited to play this. It looks fantastic. It kind of reminded us of the Telltale kind of storytelling um, episodic games. Uh, this one does come in episodes. I, just episode one is out at the moment, I think. I'm not entirely sure. But anyway, we're going to go ahead and start a new game and get right into this. There's a lot of music in this, so I'm not entirely sure if I'm going to actually be able to upload it due to copyright, but we'll see what happens. That's a nice start. I wasn't expecting this at all. It's a much darker start than I was expecting. Of course I've seen the trailers, so I know exactly what's going on. So. What's this? Look at that. Pretty amazing looking. Where am I supposed to go? Just up here? There's a storm on the hull. That is crazy. Whoa! That was so surreal. Famously called film "Little Pieces of Time," but he could be talking about photography, as he likely was. Okay, I'm in class. Everything's cool. I am okay. From light to shadow, from color to chiaroscuro. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black and white? I didn't fall asleep, and that Anybody? sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller? Weird. Diane Arbus. There you go, What's Victoria. This? Why are- Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can hear the class laughing at me now. Arbus. Okay. Because of her images of hopeless faces, you take a selfie in class. The of <laughs> okay. She saw humanity as torture. Yeah, right? no one's gonna see the flash. And frankly, it's bullshit. Shh, shh, shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie, <laughs> a dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. Of course, as you all know, the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? Uh, sure. I did know, but I kind of forgot. You either know this or not, Max. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? Louis Daguerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes, a process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. 
Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. What a bitch. The Daguerrean process brought out fine detail in people's uh, faces, making them extremely popular. I can't believe I still have this pencil case. I should upgrade to the 21st self. century. But yeah. I like it old school. You can find out all about him. I haven't kept up with my journal as much as I should. Online. Just read it. In oh, never mind. Nice hey guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. <sighs> okay, then. What is she doing? Class is over, Victoria Kate. doesn't waste a second kissing ass. Hi, Kate. Oh. Hi, Max. You seem quiet today. Just thinking too much. I hear that. Wanna go grab a cup of tea and bitch about life? Thanks, but not today. I have to go over homework. No worries. Let's hang later. Sure. Okay, then. Looks like somebody was already working on this. Cool. I also want everybody to know that this photographic world is not for everybody. Who just, use, who just leaves tablets lying around? I should have known. She'll have better equipment than Blackwell. That's one expensive camera. Holy crap. Even her school books are gift wrapped. I can't believe she made fun of me in class. What is she, 15 years old? And people laughed. Yeah, I'm just gonna take pictures of everything. <laughs> oh, I got an achievement for it, okay. Oh, okay. It's pretty neat. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes. Excuse you. No, Victoria. Excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Do I have to? I just don't think it's that big a deal. Max, you're a better photographer than a liar. Now, I know it's a drag to hear some old dude lecture you, but life won't wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, 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 right? But you do have a gift. You have the fever to take images, to frame the world only the way you envision it. Now, all you need is the courage to share your gift with others. And that's what separates the artist from the amateur. This is ridiculous. I always get so shy and nervous around Mr. Jefferson. Every time I look at Victoria, I feel like she's talking smack about me. Yeah, Victoria's a bitch. No one likes Victoria. Even in pictures, the forest around here always looks mysterious. Okay. You can never escape the lighthouse here. Oh look, another camera. Whoa, Mr. Jefferson is not messing around with that monster. He probably paid 20 grand for that camera. Probably. I bet he gets pristine across the digital other. images. But I still dig my little instant camera. Man, he even has the best plasma HDTV for a class monitor. Can't wait to watch some more documentaries on this bad boy. How cute I looked yet. I was about to. Yeah, you you Welcome to the cute. real world. Just cute. Hot. Then I might Sorry to say, but school's not the real world. The real world sucks a lot. Wants to see how she she plays it so sharp. <laughs> I need a serious time out in the bathroom. Splash water on my face and make sure I don't look like a total loser. I hate that class. It's so fucking square cool. enix. She's so fucking shy. Don't nod entertainment. And here starts the music. This is where the video gets copyrighted. I'm sure I'll work something out. Hey, Alyssa. Alyssa is always texting, but she doesn't hang out with a lot of people. 
Evan doesn't say much to me, but his photos are very cool. I love that picture of mom and dad. Yes, it is. Hello, Jack. Kiss, kiss. Andy, you look totally fabulous, as usual. Oh, Justin. That's Dana talking to... I think his name is Justin. Yes. yes. No, so we can't get beaten up as usual. I hate bully jockstraps like Logan. And he's a Vortex Club member. It looks like she's been gone for months. Oh, we're missing people. Hmm. Interesting. Where's the toilets? The bathrooms are this way. To all of you. American girls in the movie. Hello, Samuel. No one can tell you. Yeah. No. Look at these trophies. Like Gotta give it up for those big ones. They do stop. It's where the signs at the bathrooms is this way. Yeah, I literally just goes. Oh, no, it's here. Yeah. Okay. Nobody can see my meltdown, except for me. <sighs> What's that say? Rachel something something. Now who would bother to write that crap? Busy a bitch. <laughs> the last time I got a flu shot, I got the flu. Fuck you. Take a picture. There we go. No, almost. I feel like the universe is taunting me everywhere I go today. That it works. all started with that bizarro dream in class. Am I going crazy? <sighs> Just relax. Stop torturing yourself. You have a gift. Why'd you rip it up? When a door closes, a window opens. Or something like that. Okay, girl, you don't get a photo op like this every day. Yeah, take a picture of the damn butterfly. Don't get too close. Jesus. I'm gonna scare it away. Wait, isn't this the woman's bathroom? Why is he in here? It's cool, Nathan. <laughs> Don't stress. You, you're okay, bro. Just come to three. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. <laughs> you're the boss. So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step-ass would say. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. That's my family, not me. Oh, boo-hoo, poor little rich kid. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the oh, fuck he has I a gun. am or who oh, you're messing right. around with. Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Come on, put that thing down! Don't ever tell me what to do! I'm so sick of people trying to control me! You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs! Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! No! Oh. She got shot. Okay, then. That was unexpected. Whoa! What the fuck? Oh, I'm back in how, class. Okay. How can that be? I was in the bathroom. He shot that poor girl. Yeah, he did. I held up my hand. And then I was back here. Congratulations. You can control time. Pieces of time can frame us. I already heard this lecture. From light to shadow. From color. Now Kate is being hassled again. 
And if Victoria's phone rings, this is real. Oh yeah. <gasps> now, Shit. can you give me oh, an example of a photographer? Man, I cannot believe this. Captured the human condition in black and white. Okay, if I'm crazy, Anybody? I might as well go all the way. Bueller. Diane. Can I actually reverse time? Go, Victoria. Why Arvis? Yes. Yes, you can. I did it. Now, I actually did it. A photographer who Hold perfectly I'm captured a human the time machine. Black and white. Anybody? Max, Bueller? don't Diane. freak out. Not yet. There you go, Victoria. Why Arvis? Because of her Keep it together, of Max. Faces. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad. If anybody else looked at this, you're gonna read this because I didn't read think? it last time. Okay. Ah, interesting. When I took my selfie, Jefferson She's asked me a question. Tortured, right? okay. If he does again, I'll know this is for real. Let's take a Keep selfie yourself. Seriously though, I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of dust. Shh, shh, shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. I know I'm not of dreaming course, this. You all know, the it's real. Has been I can tell. The early 1800s. Your generation so I can go back in time. Selfie expression. What if that girl Sorry. isn't dead yet? I couldn't resist. The point can I save her? Yes, she can. Always been a vital aspect of art and photography for I need to go to the bathroom quickly and check it out. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please... Tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits. Uh... I'm sorry, bathroom. but I really have to use the bathroom. Nice try, Max. But you're not gonna get away that easy. We can talk more after class. Is there anybody oh, here shit. who knows their stuff? Jefferson wants to keep me you after class. And I need time to save that girl. Types? A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Shut up. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. What if I rewind again? Did you try and give him the right answer. Detail in people's faces. Okay, let's rewind and ask the question properly. Using that bitch's knowledge. Uh Okay, can I I have to keep going? Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self portraits? Yes, I can. The Daguerrean process, I'm so smart. invented by a French painter named Louis Daguerre around 1830. Somebody has been reading as well as posing. Nice work, Max. <sighs> ha, the Daguerrean bitch. process made portraiture hugely popular, mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features. You can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters. Max is so far way ahead of everyone. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. You see Max, shit. you are not crazy. You are not dreaming. It's time to be an Everyday Hero. Exactly. Let's go straight to the bathroom, yes. rescue Victoria, people, and be awesome. I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't go even away. think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Hand it in. I'm not avoiding, just... Biding time? Waiting for the elusive right moment? Exactly. 
Max, don't wait too long. John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Good for you. Let's go. Go on now. Don't let me stop you. Uh, what? So quickly undo your previous action. Why would I want to undo it? God damn it. This is just a bump on a bigger road. I don't want anybody to. F Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson. Can I talk to you for a moment? Yes. Excuse you. No, Victoria. Excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future. Yep. Skip. John Lennon said. <laughs> I'm really? on top of it. I think John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Max, you're on fire today. All the right answers. Good. Make sure you finish working on it by today. I have faith in you. Ha! Whatever your name is. Victoria? I forget. I hope I have enough time to get to the bathroom. You do. Please, It'll be fine. Let's please. go. Please. I can't That's tell anybody. Evan. They'll think I'm crazy. Yo, Daniel! Oh, I can move faster. There we go. You know I don't tease. I hate that sign. Okay, Max, retrace every step. You went to the mirror, looked at I the funny mustache. Face. I shredded my photo. Then the butterfly flew in. And I took a photo. Leave them out of this bitch! I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Don't Come on, put that thing down! Tell me Wait, five bell. Wow, sir, it's happening. I need a hammer to break it open. What? You are going Where's to the fucking hammer? More trouble for this Looks than like drug. Samuel forgot to take the cleaning cart. Move it. Here. There's the hammer. Get the hammer. Grab the hammer. Psycho. Oh. Holy shit, I can't let this happen. If I can reverse time again, I can help her. Come on. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Whoa. Don't ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me. Wait, you are going where's the hammer? Oh, I have it all of a sudden? Okay. No way. Don't ever touch me again, freak. <laughs> Another shitty day. Why are you running out of the room with a happen. gun in your hand? This cannot be Idiot. real. I just saw a girl get shot and then saved her. What the fuck is going on? You're a superhero. Do not freak out. Hey, do you hear that fire alarm? That means you should be outside. No shit. I had to use the bathroom. Girls always use that excuse. Excuse for what? Bathroom, for whatever asshole. you're up to. Your face is covered in guilt. The alarm tripped me out. Then trip on out of here, missy. Or are you hiding something? Huh? Thank Damn. you, Mr. Madsen. Is everyone the situation is under control. There's no emergency here. Leave Miss Carfield alone and please turn off that alarm since that's your job. What a dick. Is this like the headmaster or something? Yeah, the principal. You look a little stressed out. Are you okay? I'm gonna I'm, tell him. I'm just a little worried about my future. Are you sweating pinballs? Is that all you're thinking about? You could Tell always him. be up front with me, Max. Or have you done something wrong? Is that it? Well, Max, talk to me. Yeah, report him. He has a gun. He's dangerous. I just saw Nathan Prescott waving a gun around in the girls' room. Nathan Prescott. You sure? Yes. He was in the bathroom talking to himself with a gun. I saw everything. He was babbling like crazy. Okay, slow down. Slow down. So now you saw this without him seeing you. I was hiding behind a stall. I have the right to be there. It's the girls' room. I know. I know. I just want to be completely clear what happened. Mr. Prescott happens to be from the town's most distinguished... Don't care. Arrest the bastard. ...and one of Blackwell's most honored students. 
So it's hard for me to see him brandishing a weapon in the girl's bathroom. So what happened next? Then... then he left. I ran out here wondering what to do. Are you gonna bust him? This is a serious charge. Just search him. I'll look into the matter personally. Thank you for bringing it to my attention. That's it? After what I told we'll you? We'll continue this discussion later in my office. Please go outside with the rest of your class now, Miss Caulfield. Yeah, of course great, this yeah. academic drone won't do anything since the Prescott family owns Blackwell now. I don't want to change the outcome. Some recent person's posters. Rachel Amber. She looks so hopeful and pretty. I wonder what happened to her. Nope, don't want to read my time. Let's go. This day has been so insane. Everything is happening too fast. And none of it makes any sense. These visions, this power. I keep expecting to wake up one more time. But if this is a dream, then I'm not asleep. Which means somehow I did rewind time. Yes, you did. Well done, Max. So there has to be a reason. And I have to find out why. You're just going to sit there all day? Oh, look, it's a drone. <laughs> Am I supposed... Yeah, okay, I was supposed to do something. I just kind of sat there like a fucking idiot. Alright. Hey there, Stella. Hey, I know you. You're the new quiet girl in Jefferson's class. Isn't he incredible? I think so. We're lucky to have such a famous teacher. And I actually love his work. Me too. His New York urban stuff is great, but I'm glad he came back to his Oregon roots. Screw the East Coast elite. It must piss off those pretentious galleries that Mark Jefferson is teaching photography to us Blackwell Hicks. Plus, he is pretty hot for an older guy. If Victoria wasn't all over him, I would definitely make a move. Uh... Now that you mention it, he doesn't respond to Victoria's flirting. That means he has good taste. You have a lot to learn here at Blackwell. Rachel Amber absolutely had sex with him. What? Well, I heard that from a good source. So, you knew Rachel? <laughs> Not really. I saw her hanging with the other cool kids like Victoria. Not my kind of clique. But I heard insane stories about Rachel. Okay, good for you. Who are you? Okay, never mind. Oh, I got a text message. Uh. Yeah, give me a chance to read. Jesus Christ. Okay, I better get to my dorm and grab that flash drive. Okay, let's go to the dorm. Yes, let's go this way. Come on, Logan, bring it, bro. Yeah! I need to go to my room and return Warren's flash drive. What is that? Some sort of totem? I want to see what that is. It is a totem. 
Warren told me that totem is named Tabanga for a reason nobody knows. Okay. Oh, it's her. There she is. Hi, Kate. Hey, Max. How did you like class today? Nice. I don't remember. I guess I don't care about much of anything today. Is there anything... Max, I'd like to be alone, if you don't mind. I'm sorry. Something's up with her. Something's definitely up with her. Yeah, can you people move? Oh, it's her. It's you, you oh, bitch. Look, it's Max Caulfield, the selfie hoe of Blackwell. What a lame gimmick. Even Mark, Mr. Jefferson, falls for your wave hipster bullshit. The Daguerrean processor. You could barely even say that. I guess you got your meds filled. <laughs> yeah, if you could get out the way. Since you know dorm. all the answers, I guess you have to find another way into the dorm. We Easy, ain't moving. up the ladder. Oh wait, hold that pose. So original. Don't worry, Max. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post so it slow. all over social Ooh. medias. Now, why don't you go fuck your selfie? Okay. Oh yes, Bitch. Victoria. I'll get your bony ass out of my way. Hmm. I have to do something to get her out of the way. Huh? Yeah. I don't want to mess with that ladder and hurt poor Samuel. I just want to get Victoria the I could crank the sprinkler up and give Victoria and her clones incentive to beat it. Yes, let's do that. There goes Samuel da Vinci to paint the window. How do we crank the sprinklers up? Anything in here? Ooh, here we go. Ha! Ah! What the hell? Are you kidding? Fuck you guys. Look at this. Chill, Victoria. It's just water. Yeah, water on my cashmere. Do you know how much this fucking outfit costs? You look great. I can't even chill on the steps. Serves you right. Do you do you understand English? Oh, there's Get someone lost. on my way. Well then, Samuel, drop the paint on them. Yes, perfect. Now, how do I get the paint? Tamper with the bucket. Grab that. Samuel is way too close. Oh, come on. No. Rewind time. Go back, Samuel. Okay, skip. Tamper with the bucket. Okay, <laughs> let's see if this works. Surely it would break when he's lifting up though. No way! No yes. way! Hey, Victoria? Oh, Samuel, sorry. Wet, wet paint is not good for hair, nope. Sorry. Get the hell away from me, weirdo. Hold on, hold on. We'll get some towels. We'll be right back. So move your ass before I dry. And I have work. to take a picture of this. Don't Come mess on. with Max, bitches. No. Take a picture. Take a picture. Uh, hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? Let's come for her. I'm not a bitch. Well, I mean, I did, did just I cover am her. I'm sorry. Paint. That's an awesome cashmere coat. It was. But there will be another. Well, you always seem to know how to pick the right outfits. I do have some talent. Mr. Jefferson told me. I've seen your pictures. You have a great eye. Richard Avedon-esque. He's one of my heroes. Okay. Thanks, Max. See? You could be nice to your bullies. I hope those sluts get me a towel before they hang a sign on me. That's what you call your friends? Okay. You deserve a better shot. Sorry about blocking you and and the go fuck your selfie. That was mean, but pretty funny. Just one of those days, you know? I know exactly what you mean, Victoria. I'll see you later. Au revoir. There we go. Now we're friends. All is right in the world. 
Victoria probably played me. I should have played her. Better get to my room before I find Warren. No, there's no need to be an extra bitch back at people who are mean to you. Just try to be the bigger person. And pour paint on them. Sorted. Hurry, Courtney. I'd love to make a photo collage. Man, people here are merciless. What the fuck? No Victoria voice is going to oh, be hi, bye. So okay, where's my room? What the? Okay, where's the toilet bowl on the floor? Looks like nobody won this TP war. There's nothing left but ghosts. Right. Okay. Well, where's my room? Aha! Here it is. Home sweet home. My favorite cocoon. Uh... Oh, photo. Never achievement. It's hard to believe I'm 18 now. I'm lucky my parents enabled my photo habit into adulthood. She played a guitar. Not bad, Max, but I'll have to listen later just in case it gets copyrighted. I'm sorry. I will definitely replay this game just to check out everything. Obviously, I can't check everything out in this video because it would just be so freaking long. What am I looking for? I'm looking for something. Philip Lorca de Corsha, my man. I don't think I could take my camera to those places. Look at that shot. I love Julia Cameron's Victorian vibe. Talk about analog cameras. Ah, oh, Dolly, what a fantastic eye. He could truly freeze time. Well, you can rewind time, Max. It's kind of better. Oh, Max and Chloe, best friends forever. Who even says that anymore? I'm going to have to call Chloe eventually and find out what she'll say. The longer I wait, the worse it'll be. I was looking Idiot. for a pen drive or something. Pretty sure. Looks like Dana left me a little post-it note. Buried your drive. Okay. Great. Now I have to go get the flash drive from Dana's room. Yes, you do. Let's go find Dana. You can't get out now, Dana. So tell me the truth or oh. rot in there. Well, that makes things easier. Welcome to the real drama queens of Blackwell. Juliet, hey, Juliet. So is everything cool? Oh, yes, Max. I've locked Dana in the room because we're cool. What did she do? What didn't she do? Dana's been sexting with my boyfriend. Ouch. How did you find out? Uh, why do you care? Why are you even asking me? It's for curiosity, never talk. bitch. Just zone out with your camera. That's why I'm talking to you now. What's my last name? <laughs> Juliet Pats. Juliet Patson. That was truly sad. Thanks for your concern, Max Caulfield. By the way, I want to go back. There we go. Juliet looks like she's ready to throw down. Hey, Juliet. What was it again? I forgot. Oh, yes, Max. I've locked Dana in the skip. Juliet Watson, you be nice. I'm flattered. I didn't even think you knew my name at all. Well, I'm just, of course, I do. You know, I just pay attention. Thanks. I locked Dana in because she was sexting Zach, my boyfriend. Unbelievable. How do you know? Victoria Chase. You know her. You could say that. Unfortunately. But why would Dana go after your boyfriend? According to Victoria, Dana would do anything to date a quarterback. According to Victoria? Huh. She saw the sext. 
and Zachary won't answer his phone. Once Dana admits it, she can go. Straight to hell. Max, I swear I didn't do anything, but I bet Victoria did. I know the proof is in her This room. girl must have been popular. She's everywhere. Do I have to go talk to Victoria now? Ugh. I hate Victoria. No need to go there now. Oh, good. Then let me in. Leave me alone, Max. Get a clue. Uh, where am I supposed to get a clue from exactly? Hmm, where am I supposed to get a clue? Let's see. Can't go in the showers because reasons. Aha, Victoria's room. We get to go into this bitch's place. Ouch. Well, at least she puts her photographs out there. Unlike me. Hmm. There's a camera. She's she actually a got a classic really medium format camera with some awesome prime lens. How many tablets does she have? Is she going to get a 3D printer for her dorm room? Wow. Maybe I will join her posse. Yeah, really. Uh, what am I looking for here? Let's use her laptop. I'll give Victoria props for not posting my photo. Boom. This is the email I need to show Juliet. Now I have to print this fast and get the hell out of here. Um, okay. Print it. Wait, where is it? Ah, there it is. This better convince Juliet that Dana is innocent. Okay, let's go. Let's get out of here before she returns. Oh, wait, I need a picture of that wall. Wait, I want a picture of that wall. Go back. Go back. And, uh... Oh, I can mess it up. Wait. No, I'm not going to be an evil person. I am not going to be an evil person. We made peace. We could be friends. Juliet, read this. Of course. I'm an asshole. I'm sorry, Dana. You are. And I hope so. You really think I'd mess around with Zachary? No, but I get stupid jealous. I owe you dinner. Still love me? And you do my laundry. Thanks, Max. You're like the Blackwell Ninja. Now let's see what Zach has to say about Victoria. You set me free. <laughs> Thank you. Warren's flash drive is on my desk. Don't mind if I do. I'll just grab that flash drive, get the hell out of here. Almost done. Get the flash drive, and then I'll go see Warren. Must protect my precious, so Max never has to chase it down again. Max, you're going crazy on me. Don't go crazy. I mean, do you mind if I use your laptop? Okay, thank you. I better make sure everything is still in there. How I do I think know? Warren forgot to hide the party buster folder. Not that I would open it no matter how tempting. Yeah. I have my self-respect. Yeah, you probably shouldn't. So. Hey, Dana. Dana, Seriously, that's your name. thanks again. I can't believe Juliet locked me in my own room. Real mature. Very. Very nice uh, Illuminati earrings you have there. Poor Juliet gets her rage on. I hope she doesn't kill Victoria. Zachary should worry, too. As if I'd let that ego case jockstrap touch me. But I bet Victoria would be all over that action. Or has been. Max, you're smart to be a loner here. Though Warren obviously likes hanging with you. He's a good guy. A geek like me. You saw the files in his flash drive. Tons of crazy shit. Films I've never even heard of. And in a special folder called Max. Yeah, okay. I gotcha. Yeah. Okay, let's go. Where do I find Warren? Oh, I have a text.
He's in a parking lot. Okay. Let's go to the parking lot. Oh, she's gone. Fuck this shit. Ow! That hurt. Damn. I better rewind. Yeah, really. What the hell just happened? Dude, chill. Zachary, Get speak lost, to me. lost, hipster. I'm not doing any Uh, the, the, the lady. Shit. You sh Ow! That hurt. Zachary, stop hitting her with your ball. Okay, Alyssa, you should probably move. Alyssa, move your head. If you insist, Max. Now that's go. what I'm talking about. I actually helped somebody. This action will have consequences. I don't care. At least she didn't get hit in the head with a ball. Which is a Victoria one. Okay, good to know. <laughs> Honestly, some people just don't learn. So don't think I'm blind. I see everything here at Blackwell. Do you understand what I'm saying? No, and leave me alone. Yeah, take a photo. You can't fool me. I know everything about this school. I cover the waterfront. So you better figure out what side you're on. Please, leave me alone. Who's with this guy? Hope you enjoyed the show. Thanks for nothing, Max. You're welcome. Man, I should have stepped in between Kate and Fine. Kate. That asshole was Fine. so over the line. Why can't I rewind faster? I could faster? rewind and try something different. <sighs> Let's intervene. Hey, why don't you leave her alone? Excuse us, this is official campus business. And you're a douchebag security guard. You be yelling at students or bullying them. Hey, hey, nobody is bullying anybody. I'm doing my job. No, you're not. You're part of the problem, Missy. I will remember this you conversation. You asshole. Oh, Max, that was great. I think you scared him for once. I, I have to go, but thank you. It means a lot. Anytime, You're welcome. Kate. All right, let's get out of here. I felt like an everyday hero helping I Kate. I was supposed to go this way. Now, Officer David Dickhead is after me. Maybe I should rewind. No, no minding your own business. Oh, there he I'm is. glad I stepped in that time. Can't stand to see people being bullied. No, he's another missing person. At least person. Rachel Amber has people who care about her. Yeah. Come on over here, please. What up, Max? How are you? Here's your flash. Thanks. No problem. Check out my new wheels. Cool. Very old school. 1978 to be exact. Now we can go to the drive-in. There's one in Newburgh just 60 miles away. You're in the wrong time, Warren. But then, so am I. You okay? It's been one strange fucking day. I bet. I heard Victoria got a face full of paint. I'd pay money to see a photo yeah, of that. Yeah, I wish I could take a photo. Really? I wish I would've known. You probably could've raised a Kickstarter fund just for that one image of her covered in paint. Had I known that, Anyway, Victoria took down my photo, so that drama ended well. So, did you get a chance to check out the movie booty on my flash drive? Uh, I've been busy. No, I've been way too busy with class and life. Damn, girl, you had it like a year. Or a week. I did browse through all the titles, Drama Queen. Ha ha. Make sure you watch Cannibal Holocaust. No fucking way will I watch that. My mind is twisted enough. 
I laughed my ass off. So you're sensitive. Ouch, that sounds awful the way you say it. <laughs> what? No, I was impressed you had faster pussycat kill kill. Russ Mayer was a genius of black and white. Plus, babes with breasts. Who would beat your sensitive ass down? If I was lucky. Speaking of hip and fast, we should cruise out in my car to an actual movie this week. But you seem distracted. I need to talk to somebody, just to get it out of my system. Dr. Warren Graham is in the house. I won't even prescribe you any meds. Tell me everything. I don't know if For I can. Mm. This is between you and me, not social media. Don't insult me. No one's gonna believe you. Go on. I had this incredibly bizarro experience in Mr. Jefferson's class today. I mean, life-changing. Have you ever had a dream so real it was like a movie? Max Caulfield, right? You're one of the Jefferson's photo groupies? I'm one of his students. What the fuck ever? I know you like to take pictures, especially when you're hiding out in the bathrooms. You best tell me what you told the principal, now. Oh, oh, it's him. Answer me, oh, bitch. God. What are you talking about? I know you're new here, but don't even play stupid with me. I'm not new. I've lived here for years. Then you should know the Prescotts own this shithole. Then you don't have to worry about me. Worry about yourself. Do not analyze me. I pay people for that. Worry about yourself, Max Caulfield. Um, yeah, let's just be friends. Take a step back, Nathan Prescott. Oh man, you're telling me what to do? Get away yeah, I from am, her, dude. Kid. Ooh, ow. Hey, okay. leave him alone. Nobody tells me what to do. Not my parents, not the principal, that. or that whore Wait, in the bathroom. No. Oh, that was close. Max? Chloe? No way. You again. Warren. Go, go, I got this. Oh, uh, Jesus. Hey, Max. Warren. Get your punk asses out of there now! Whoa. Don't even try to run! Nobody! Crazy. Nobody! There's Kid's no crazy. To the town. Man, Nathan Prescott is messed up and dangerous. This day never ends. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. After five years, you're still Max Caulfield. Don't give me the guilty face. At least pretend you're glad to see me. I am seriously glad to see you. Oh, nice Illuminati oh, shit in the background Chloe. again. It makes perfect sense I'd see you today. Yes, it's been that kind of day. So what did that freak want with you? Uh, I have no idea. I have no idea. I know he's a press card. And an asshole. Your friend really stood up for you. Warren? Yeah, I owe him big time. You're not the only one in debt. Ooh. And you're already causing trouble. I thought it would be quiet here. It feels so weird to be back. So I guess Seattle sucked hard? I guess. It was cool, but I felt kind of lonely out of my league. I would think you'd fit right in with the art school hipsters. Right. You look like the cover of hipstergirl.com. At least you're still a smartass. That's why I'm here. Please, girl. You came back for Blackwell Academy. Of course. It's one of the best photography programs in the country. And my favorite teacher, Mark Jefferson. So you came back to Arcadia for a teacher, not your best friend. Don't you think I'm happy to see you? No. You were happy to wait five years without a call or even a text. I wanted to. I was just so tripped out over leaving Arcadia. Oh, please. I'm sure your f phone no, and laptop happened? were frozen in time. You're merciless. You've been at Blackwell for almost a month without letting me know. Enough said. I just wanted to settle in first and not be such a shy, cliche geek. I totally would have contacted you. I bet you don't use these sad excuses on Mr. Jefferson. Don't use them on me, Max. Are you 
this cereal? Wait, didn't wow, we? Wow, haven't heard that one in a while. Let me fix it, or Not did it changes. break again? Except my camera has officially taken a shit. My step douche has a boatload of tools. Maybe you can fix it in my place. I need very specific tiny tools. Bird alert. My stepdad has a fully stocked garage, and he actually is a tiny tool. Welcome home, Max. Come on in, don't be shy. The house still looks nice. Home shit home. <laughs> home shit home. <laughs> My room looks a bit different than the last time you saw it. It's cool. At least we can chill out. This isn't exactly my chill out zone. My step fear makes sure of that. Come in and close the door. Put on some music while I medicate. Oh, you're medicating. Great. It won't play without any power. Well, then put the power on. Now, let's see what kind of music Chloe is into these days. Okay, well, where's her music? This postcard is from Rachel Ember. Huh. Okay. We had such a blast drawing these together. Well, she still keeps them, so that's a good sign. Glass snow dough. Thanks. Uh, yeah. One moment, and I shall have that sorted. Okay, and how do I get the glass? And it reeks like dirty laundry. Gross. Lovely. Oh, this is a flashback to youth. Our super secret closet lair. Chloe totally yeah, don't mind me, staff. I'm just going through all your I stuff. Really recognized her. Okay, where is your music? What's this? There it is. Okay. Hey, give me that. Sorry, I wasn't trying to be nosy. Obviously, she was a good friend. It's putting it mildly. <laughs> That's Rachel Amber. Her missing person posters are all over Blackwell. Yeah, I put them up. She was my angel. After my dad died and you moved, I felt abandoned. Rachel saved my life. Man, I had no idea. Well, you never made much effort to find out. I was 14. We were best friends. So, Rachel took my place. I'm glad she was there for you. Rachel had my back. We were gonna kick the world's ass. You would laugh at how different we were. She wanted to be a star. She looks like a model. That was her plan. Our plan. Get the hell out of Bigfootville and into Los Angeles. So what happened? Did your folks, your mom, try to stop you? My mom was too busy hooked up with Sergeant Shithead. I feel the love. Now, when did Rachel actually disappear? Six months ago. She just left Arcadia. Without a word. Without me. What about her parents? 
Are they looking for her? They're in denial. Max, I know she's missing. I assume you know more than that. Before Rachel left, she said she met somebody who changed her life. And poof. And you haven't heard anything from her since? Like everybody in my life. My dad, you, and Rachel. Gone. Can you put on some music now? Sure thing. Anyway, drugs, kids. you can find tools to fix your camera in the garage. Chloe, are you okay? Sure, I'm awesome. I just want to blaze and be alone for a moment. Okay, you do that. I'm gonna go to the garage. Yes, go downstairs. What is that? Okay. Oh, message. Yeah, that guy is an asshole. Chloe, if you're listening, Pete was cruising home off duty and told me he saw you near that garbage dump. Now I'm ordering. I should be able to find the tools I need here. Yes, let's see. Uh, uh, what's this? She's so clumsy. Butterfingers. Kate Marsh? Why the hell would he have pictures of her? Okay, this is getting totally weird. What the hell? Okay, I'm gonna put these back. Because people be crazy. At least now I know, so, you know. Chloe's stepdad is head of security at Blackwell. Oh, it's him! He wants to put surveillance cameras all over the school? How paranoid can you get? It's a douchebag. That's her stepdad? Jesus Christ. Chloe's stepdad is a veteran and a security guard? He must really hate her. Huh. Switch on. Oh, I see. Switch off. I don't want to mess with stuff in here, because he'll know. If I can know, I'm in here. Should I switch this on? Yeah, switch it on. What the? Chloe's stepdad actually installed cameras in the rooms? For real? Wow. This guy has serious trust issues. Do Chloe and Joyce even know about this? This guy really does have issues. Holy crap. Shut the cabinet. Wait, what's this? Wowzer, a map of Blackwell Academy. I wonder why. Because this is where he wants all his cabinets to be. Ah, there's... wait. Hmm, what's his password? No password. Like it would help me find tools anyway. Oh, his password's got to be around here somewhere. I mean, he probably writes them down. Okay, who keeps food in their garage? These are way too big. I need tiny tools for that camera. Yeah, you should do, Max. Well done. So where are these tiny tools? Oh, is this the same one? Okay, I don't want to go for that. Uh, have I looked in here? Yeah, I have. Stepdad yeah, is yeah, a yeah, 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 yeah. And I haven't seen this place in five years. I've looked in here too. Chloe's stepdad is head okay. of security at Black. Nothing. This is so lame. We've got to be here somewhere. Poor little dear. It's not enough to kill you, they have to display your head. Yeah, I never really got the whole... K 
killing animals and mounting their head on the wall thing. Ah, what's that? Aha! Ooh, precision screwdrivers. Except I can't reach them. Or turn on the washing machine. Ta da! That was very smart, dumbass. No can reach. Reach your hand under it's not exactly. Oh, I know exactly what I have to do here. That was very smart, dumbass. Don't worry, go back. No can reach. Go back further. Must go back further. Okay, skip. All right, tools are up there. Let's push this underneath first. Then turn on the washing machine. Skip that. Blah blah blah. Tools fell down. Turn off the washing machine. Okay, yada yada yada. And then pull this out and voila! Yes. The tools you have are right there. Skills, I am so smart. Okay, well I think I'm done here pretty much. I've got the tools. I should go back upstairs before Chloe freaks. It's a good idea. Hey, where's Chloe's room? Oh, here it is. <laughs> Not having much luck, are you? So? I can't fix this thing. Are these your new photos? Yeah. I just took them today. Let me see. Wait. I've seen this before. Uh, no way. When did you take this? You took this photo, you brat? In the bathroom today. You set off the alarm. That's why Nathan raged after you. It totally makes sense. You hella saved my life. Now tell me the truth, Max. Yep, yeah, I was there. I was there, hiding in the corner. Damn, you're a ninja. A ninja would have cut Nathan's head off. I just took a butterfly photo. That is so badass. Oh yeah, I almost wet myself when I saw the gun. So, did you recognize me? I wasn't sure. I know I look a lot different. I was scared too, I, I couldn't see straight. I don't blame you, Max. Like you said, it's been that kind of day. So you must have overheard our conversation. Just a bit. There is no way you didn't hear every single vowel. Okay, I only heard something about money, drugs, but that's it. Now for the big question. Did you tell anybody? Uh, well, yes. Absolutely, Nathan Prescott had a fucking gun on you. Gutless prick. How scary. Who did you tell? The principal. But he didn't seem to believe me. The principal? Are you still 12? That drunk jackass only cares about cash for Blackwell Academy. Don't trust him. I didn't mention you at all. Swear. Thank God. I'll tell you more someday. And I seriously owe you, Max. I, uh, know it was your birthday last month. <laughs> this was my real camera? father's camera. But I want you to have it. Ooh, nice. That's so cool you remembered my birthday. But I can't take this. Of course you can. My dad would be pissed if I never used it, and now I know it'll be used awesomely. And I'll snag this picture as a symbol of our reunion. Cool? Yes, of course it's cool. Thank you. This camera is so sweet. Now that we got that mushy shit out of the way, I feel like stage diving. Let's thrash this place. You're crazy. Yep, yep, I'm fucking insane in the brain. Let's dance. Shake that bony white ass. Or take my picture with your new camera. Let's <laughs> <laughs> take a picture. This 
song fucking rules. Can't dance, hippie? Come on. Rock out, girl. Yes, break it down, Max. Uh-oh. Yo, turn it off. Turn it off. How many times have I told you to stop blasting that punk shit? Dude, the music's not even on. Asshole. I'm coming up. We need to talk. Oh, no fucking way. You need to hide now. My stepdad will kill me if he finds you here. Okay. Chloe, um. What's going on? Open this door, please. Chill. I'm changing. Is that okay? Max, what do I do? Place to hide now. Okay. Chloe. I'm coming. What are you doing? Chloe, you're stalling. Hide. I'm changing. Give me a minute. Don't get smart. Just oh no. What? Let me in now. Uh, wait. Go back. Oh, you're stalling. Let's move I'm this. I'm changing. Give me a minute. Don't get smart. Just let me in now. Hide. Please. One second. My bra is stuck. I'm not screwing around, soldier. Chloe. Shit. What's going on in here? Jesus, I'm just trying on clothes. You're so friggin' paranoid. Yeah, combat. We'll do that to you. One of my guns is missing. Wait, what? Did you take it? Oh god, I didn't take your stupid gun. You do know I believe in gun control? Wait, is that grass? You been token up again in here? Oh yeah, guns, weed. You were tripping balls. I'm sick of your disrespect. Can I like... Tell me the truth. That's an order. Rewind time and... Who's this? Hide that. Uh, I'm gonna step in. I'm, I'm gonna sorry. take the fall for this. That was my joint. Well, well. I don't like strangers in my home, especially dopers. So you're bringing drugs into my home. How about if I call the police? That'd screw up your spotless Blackwell record. You do seem to get around, Max. I'm sick of you losers dragging Chloe down. Missy, you sure do like to pop up and start trouble. What an asshole. Like this afternoon. You don't have anything smart to say now, do get you? Get the hell away from huh? her, man. Stop harassing my friends. You don't have any friends. Like you know. You're not even a real cop. You're a fucking security guard. I was a soldier, Chloe. And Max, if I see you here again, you'll learn all about real trouble. Because you're such a badass, Max, let me show you my new toy. What is it? I'm Price. Chloe Price. Bang! Jeez. She has the Let's fucking gun? Down. Oh Chill my back, god. Sister. It's not even loaded. Yet. I thought you believed in gun control. Yes, I believe I should control the gun. It's the men who need to be checked. You trust Nathan or David? Thanks for taking the heat. We totally smacked his punk ass down, Max. He's no match for you and me now. That was an epic win. If you anyway, say so. Let's sneak out the window. There is one cool place we can hang in this hickle. We need to go out the window? Man, that did not go well for me. If I want to keep my Blackwell scholarship, I shouldn't lie for anybody. Even Chloe. Well, I have to think about my own future. I, uh, we're gonna leave it as it is for now. Really, you can't use stairs like normal people? Escape Mr. and Pretty. I like it. I really like the art style in this game. Oh, hello. Nice of you to pop up. Isn't this awesome sauce? Totally reminds me of when we were kids. Come on, slowpoke. Hold on. I haven't been here in forever. So why do I feel like I was just here? Well, is this the place with the lighthouse? Oh, this is the exact same path I was exactly. on during the nightmare today. Where's that deer? I want to take a picture of that deer. No, it's gone. Never mind. Oh. 
Oh, what you want, Warren? Whoa! That's one hell of a black eye. Birds and how did you take so that lucky. picture in one hand? They can always escape. Wait. Hang on, I've got to look at that again. Hang on. Oh, okay, that's possible. What is this? I don't remember this at all, but it seems like it's been here for a long time. Looks like the youth of Arcadia Bay still come up here to party. I never made it. Okay, where did Chloe go? Is she inside? Too bad it's locked. I remember racing up and down the steps. Okay, well, the bigger question is where's Chloe? Weird. Those glyphs remind me of the wind. They remind you of the wind? A tree haiku? How pretty. Okay. Where the hell is Chloe? Oh, there she is. She's on the bloody bench. Sure you don't want to be alone? Have a seat, Pete. My pleasure. Feels nice out here after all that drama. You really took one for Team Chloe. I'm not as brave as you. And David is indeed a step douche. I'm sorry you had to experience it firsthand. You have to live with him. Has he always been this way? Ever since my desperate mom dragged his ass to our home, I never trusted David. He freaked out on poor Kate Marsh today. I know her. She's cool. Only that prick would bully her. He has some kind of weird agenda. He has a lot of secret files. Rambo still thinks he's gathering enemy intelligence. Did you take a peek? Well, yeah. I couldn't help it. Never change. What did you find? Creepy photos of Kate Marsh. Other Blackwell students. This dude takes his job too seriously. He still thinks he's at war or something. He's a total surveillance fetish. Where are there spy cams in the house? I knew you didn't know. Chloe, your house is under surveillance. What are you talking about? There are cameras all over the house. I saw it on a monitor in the garage. I knew it! He's so hella fucking paranoid! I'll keep this a secret for now. Sometimes ignorance is bliss. No wonder I'm so miserable. Everybody in this town knows everybody's secrets. What's Nathan's secret? He's an elite asshole who sells bad shit cut with laxative. And he dosed me with some drug in his room. What? I met him in some shithole bar that didn't card me. He was too rich for the place and too wasted, and he kept flashing bills. Just tell me what happened, Chloe. Now. I was an idiot. I thought he was so blazed it would be an easy score. You needed money that bad? Actually, yes. I owe big time. And I thought I'd have enough for me and Rachel if she showed up. How much do you owe? Three grand plus interest. Wow, that's a lot. And before I could get a chunk of that from Nathan, he dosed my drink with some shit. God, Chloe, I can't believe this. I mean, I do. Then what? I know I passed out on the floor. I woke up and that perv was smiling, crawling towards me with a camera. Go on. Everything was a blur. I tried to kick him in the balls and broke a lamp. Nathan freaked, so I managed to bum rush the door and get the hell out. <sighs> Max, it was insane. Chloe, that is so fucked up. What did you do then? I figured I would make him pay me to keep quiet. So we met in the bathroom. And he brought a gun. That was Nathan's last mistake. What are you going to do? Pop a cap in his ass? Let's call the police. Screw that. You already told the principal, and I'm sure it's useless. I won't always be there to save you. You were here today, Max. You saved me. I'm still tripping on that. Seeing you after all these years feels like... Destiny.
If this is destiny, I hope we can find Rachel. I miss her, Max. This shit pit has taken away everyone I've ever loved. I'd like to drop a bomb on Arcadia Bay and turn it to fucking glass. Uh oh, what's happening? Oh no! Not again! Wait, what? Why is this happening to me? I don't know, Max, it's a good question. Why am I here again? Again, I don't know, that's a good question. The deer is a ghost. It's a ghost deer. Okay then. Come on, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's find out what's going on here. Is Chloe still up there? I have to find out. Yeah. Well. Whoa. Can I climb over it? No. What do you want me to do, game? Oh, now I can get past it. Ah, oh, sweet. Is he going to fall again? That answers that question. Oh god. It looks like there's blood on either side every time. Whoa, 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 whoa. Calm down there, logs. Yeah, it looks like there's blood every time I rewind. That's kind of interesting. I wonder if it's doing some sort of damage. Oh my lord! The tornado is back! Yep. What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? I can't do anything. Oh god! It almost hit me. Oh no, there's a newspaper. Let's read around the newspaper in the storm. October 11th? Is this Friday? That's only four days away! Oh, that's interesting. You can tell the future. Oh, no. The tornado is headed straight for the town. Oh, wow. Chloe, you're here. I'm back. Oh, my lord, this is real. It's real. Oh, man, this sucks. Max, what's going on? You totally blacked out. I didn't black out. I had another vision. The town is going to get wiped out by a tornado. Oregon gets about five tornadoes every 20 years, which is so. No, no, I saw it! I could actually feel the electricity in the air. Come on, take a breath, okay? Chloe, I'm crazy. not crazy. But there's something else I have to tell you. Something hardcore. Talk to me, Max. I had the same vision earlier in class. When I came out of it, I discovered it for the first time. Like I said, not crazy. But. Hi, right? Listen to me. How do you think I saved you in the bathroom? By reversing time? Yeah, sure. I saw you get shot, Chloe. Saw you actually die. I was able to go back and hit the fire alarm. Okay, I see you're a geek now with a great imagination, but this isn't anime or a video game. People don't have those powers, Max. I don't know what I have, but I have it. And I'm scared shitless. You need to get high. It's been a hell insane fucking day. This is what snowing? the hell is this? Snowflakes? It's like 80 degrees. How? Climate change. Or a storm is coming. Max, start from the beginning. Oh, now Do you me believe me? Because of the snow? Okay, that makes sense. Please don't end. I don't want it to end.
Oh, she found her way. What the hell? This is crazy. It. <laughs> oh my god, that was that was fantastic. That was absolutely fantastic. So glad I got this game. Amazing. All right, everyone. Well, I guess that ends episode one of Life is Strange. I don't know when episode two is going to be released, but I cannot wait for it to be released. That was fantastic. The whole rewind time aspect was an amazing concept and they pulled it off incredibly well. And I just cannot wait to see where this story leads. It is going to be one hell of a journey, I just know that much. So thank you all for watching and I will see you next time. Goodbye. Oh, there's more. Oh, crap. What's going on here? What? Oh, no. Come in March 2015. All right. Can't wait for that. <laughs> I'll say goodbye again, everyone. See you later.